Hello all you people out there on YouTube, it's David here from DP Computing and today we've just got a um, HP ProBook 440 G2 laptop. I'm just going to do a basic teardown to get the battery, um, memory hard drive and so forth. Um, just a word of warning before you start, please perform these steps at your own risk and take anti-static precautions. I'm just getting my wrist strap now, I'll just pop that on. Now, uh, as I said, proceed at your own risk. First thing to do is make sure the power is disconnected, which is up here, and then remove the battery, which is here. So to remove the battery, there's two little clips here. Um, the first one, you see clips across, and there's a little red, um, uh, I suppose, indicator there. The other one just sli slides across, and then the battery pops up, which we can then move. So there's the battery. The battery itself, um, it says replace with HP Spare 756744-001, which is just written on a little tag there. Now we just have got one screw there, so remove that one screw. Now I believe this screw doesn't remove totally, so just do it until it screws no more, and then push it upwards, or push that way. And as you can see, it just uh, slides off and there we've got memory and the hard drive and an empty socket for more RAM. Now to remove the memory there's two little silver tabs just pull them outwards and the memory will pop up which we can then remove and then just slide it back in and push it down to put it back in. The hard drive itself is held in by four screws just remove those screws And then just under here is a little tab thing. Just pull that up. And we've got that tab which we can then slide the hard drive to the outwards and then lift it out. And there's the hard drive itself. The hard drive is in a little metal caddy and is held in by another four screws. So one, two, three, four. Just remove those screws and the hard drive will um, be able to be removed. You can then replace the hard drive or upgrade it to an SSD drive or what have you. Um, we've also got another little panel here which we can slide to remove. And you can see under here we've got another screw. Uh, there's one screw there for the keyboard and another screw here for the um, optical drive. So remove the optical drive screw. Oh, just a word of warning, that screw is a bit bigger than the previous screws we removed. Probably can't see, I'll just see there. So just make note of which, where the screws go. Um, now just... Can we get it? There we are. If needed you can sort of give it a bit of a push through there, but you can generally pull it out. And there's the optical drive. The optical drive has a little bracket here, which is held in by another two Phillips head screws. Um, let me see. It's a branded Hewlett Packard optical drive, and the model number is SU-208. So there we go. And then we've got the, the wireless card here, which is held in by two screws and the two antennas. Now there we have it, a quick teardown or a basic teardown of a HP ProBook 440G2. Thank you for watching and please check out our channel for other um, YouTube or other laptop teardowns. Thanks again, I'll catch you next time. Bye for now.